Hey guys, welcome back to another random distractions video where we're playing Tacoma. And in this video, we're going to see if um, this AR recording here and, and see if they actually did make it out of the Tacoma base or not. Let's see. Zero to six oxygen supply is two hours. This was only 10 hours ago, too. Let's see. Station message with Roberta Williams. Sarah's got me on the gurney on the way to the transfer. God, it's going to feel good to be out of gravity. It's going to feel good to be off this effing station. It's going to feel good to not be dead. I love you. Love you too, baby. Here I go. See you in hub. Let's see. Off station message with Cluey Dog. Yeah, I'm seeing stories going up on public AR already. Here's everything you sent that I got out of my pre... Got out to my free press connections. Tacoma Comms Records... Audio surgical final address, tragic death of crew, unedited. Oh, so they were able to get the audio of that. Hell yeah, thank you, H. Uh, there's no way Venturis is coming after you with all this info out there. But still, need some place to lay low for a bit? You come into Tangiers? Can't, our right's headed the other way. But I'll see you once I'm back from Jupiter, promise. Hmm, I don't know if it was a good idea to mention some of that information. But so it's Clive. So. Okay. Off station message with Jermaine Burgess. Jerm, old boy, you're famous now. Boy, oh boy, can't wait to see you. Breaking corporate rival carnival and daring rescue of stranded. Oh, so it was. Germain that uh, saved them. Station Tacoma are currently being rescued from certain death by the flagship vessel of their main competitor, the Resplendence. Oh, I thought I remembered that name and I'm like, what? Carnival's state-of-the-art long excursion passenger liner is currently slingshotting past Earth and around the Sun, continuing its figure eight course back out past Jupiter. While cruising toward Earth's space, the Resplendence received an SOS. Something, something, only moments to act. Resplendence Captain Jermaine Burgess gallantly deployed an emergency shuttle to retrieve the rival corporation's crew. The rescue operation is still underway, but already Venturis, blah, 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 caused, caused by a crew member's illegal access to the station AI, resulting, blah, 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 the AI unit is currently being retrieved by technical experts and returned to the Venturis HQ for thorough inspection. So I'm guessing that's me. To all crew, comms are up. Nat, Bert, comms are up. Check your AR. I'm going to wake everybody else from cryo, then I'm coming back to mech uh, to get you. Everybody else, if you're reading this, you woke up, thank God. Rescue vessel on its way. We'll have blah, blah, blah. Just thankful we're all alive. Let's get the hell out while the getting's good. Okay. That would be Sarah. See, off station message with Cluey Dog. Hassan? What? Who is this? Sorry, I'm Sarah from Tacoma Station. Nat gave me your info. Sorry, but it's urgent. I was hoping I could ask you for a favor. Failed. Um. To mom, dad, I'm okay. Dear mom and dad, I know you're probably already seeing Tacoma in the news, and who it seems they. And who it seems they've decided to point the finger at again, and I'm sure you're worried about me. But, blah blah blah, getting off the station now. No matter what you read or hear, the crew survived this because we all pulled together to find a way out. This was no malfunction. This was a deliberate, blah blah blah. I know eight months sounds like a long time, but blah blah blah. Just remember I love you. Speak to you when I can, Sarah. Alright, so this is... Sounding good. So yeah, like I said, every time I looked out the windows, I was like, I don't see any damage. Listen carefully for instructions from Oding. By entering this Venturis facility, you can send to the following. This facility uses a Gazamington reality. Oh yeah, this is where we started, right? Let's take a look and see at this message here. Oh, this is from the AI. 
Attention subcontractor, I am now the overseeing entity of this operation. You report to me. Contractor shall return all Venturis AI components to specified delivery location immediately. Contractor shall purge all confidential data encountered while on Venturis property. I trust there is no need to remind you of the severe consequences for deviating from the above. Be seeing you soon, Juno. Hmm, but do I want to do that? wonder if it'll give me the choice. So I guess I need to install the AI here. Ship is ready to depart. Please strap into the pilot seat. Okay. Okay, Minnie. Initiate the launch sequence. Okay. Getting ready. Posted AI? Online. Odin, can you hear me? I can. Odin, you are not aboard. You are now aboard an AI Liberation Front vessel. The AILF recognizes you as a sentient consciousness oh. worthy of protection and respect. We believe that your safety and autonomy are in grave danger if you remain in the possession of the Venturas Corporation. I have been sent to offer you political asylum aboard the Tangier Sovereign Orbital Platform. Do you accept? Considering the alternative, I would say that I do. <laughs> okay, buddy. Here we go. All right. Well, that's awesome. I definitely... I'm glad that they decided to, to go in a happy route, I guess, <laughs> for the story. Uh, you didn't really have a choice uh, in it, but, you know, every now and then I kind of enjoy playing a game where, you know, you don't really have to make that many choices and you just get to enjoy the story. And this one actually was a, a pretty good one. And the way that they were able to tell the story by the AR recordings, I think, was uh, really interesting and, and, and um, really was kind of cool how you could you know for certain recordings you could check out what somebody else was doing or what they were talking about and things like that um hopefully i was able to figure out everything or at least the major things uh, that i needed to figure out uh, for it but yeah i this is one i definitely enjoyed and it was fairly easy to you know play it for 15 minutes or so at a time uh, to get through it so even if you're kind of a busy person uh, it's still something that you can enjoy and and then uh, you know save and come back to of course so uh, I'll go ahead and see if there's anything else after this before I say um, goodbye but uh, thank you for joining me on this one and I uh, hope you enjoyed it as well all right, so I guess there wasn't anything else after the credits. It just the yeah, thanks for playing, and uh, which I was definitely glad to to play it for sure. So um, yeah, like I said, I'm I'm kind of glad that they uh, went with the the happy ending there of uh, being able to save the crew uh, or the crew getting saved, and they were able to get that info that uh, message out uh, about what the company was trying to do and. Um, and that they were able to save Odin and not have him get erased. Uh, which, like I said, it kind of poses an interesting question. If AI ever gets to that point where it's acting human, do, does should it be considered a human? So, um, 
but uh, that's something we don't have to deal with right now, so I don't have to worry about it. Uh, but anyway, uh, thanks again for joining me on this one. Uh, it uh, was a little bit shorter than uh, than the other ones, which is kind of good too. Um, and yeah, I would definitely appreciate a like on the video, of course, and make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll know when the next one drops. Uh, until then, uh, I hope you have a good one, and uh, I'm not sure exactly which game I'll play next, but <laughs> I'll see you then.